Hey sports fans, today you're lucky enough to get a tour of 123 Villa 450 V Marina apartment. Have fun! Hello, like for a pillow? <laughs> what? I don't know if I like that. Next one. Take two. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> Come on in. Hey, thanks. <laughs> Welcome to our apartment in Marina del Rey. Fabulous. It's pretty chilly in here. What's the temperature at? Just an easy breezy 69 degrees. Nice. So Perfect this, sleeping this temperature. This is the least favorite part of the house for me because that guy has to sleep like a polar bear. Nice. Anyway, this is our lovely kitchen that we redid during quarantine. Wow. When we moved in, it was brown marble, granite, whatever it was, and I hated it. And so we finally, in the last year, in the last few months of us living here, we changed it. And it is so perfect. I'm obsessed with it. 10 out of 10 recommend doing contact paper on your kitchen because it looks amazing. It does. What's your favorite appliance in the kitchen? That is so hard because I really love this copper mixer. I've wanted this my whole life and we got it for our wedding registry. But then this is the coffee corner where we spend lots of our time and this espresso machine in this sparkling water situation. I heard probably my top three favorites. Can wow. I have three? You can have three. What's your favorite? I also really love the white Oh my knives. gosh. I just love our kitchen. What's your favorite appliance that sits on top of a fridge? The air fryer. Absolutely. Oh, what are your favorites? That's a good one. I like the air fryer. Air fryer is key. We cook everything in the air fryer. In my electric kettle. From Smeg. Smeg, we love Smeg. Oh, I love the toaster too. Oh, the toast. Don't forget about the toaster. You have like 10 favorite things in here. I love the kitchen. Mm. We have a great kitchen. Nice. What's next? Well, let's walk to the room we spend the most time in. Which is? The living room. Oh, the living room. Also got a revamp during quarantine because we put up curtains, curtain rods. Shout out cameraman. Did a great job. Really brought the room together. Makes it feel more private and a little bit more elevated. What's your favorite part of the living room, babe? Hmm. Well, you. Oh, that's a good answer. But yeah, this is our signed Viking football. Oh, that's that we nice. have to give a shout out to because we love it. Really completes the room, you know? Yep, great poof. The poof is one of my pride and joys. We got this right when we moved in. Our mother helped us stuff it to perfection. Shout out, Debbie. We love Debbie. And yeah, this is a really great room. We love the high ceilings. That's really what got us excited about the apartment. Look and the crown molding great is just ceiling. stunning. Just great. Just love it. 10 out of 10. What's that thing over there on the corner? Underneath the mirror. Oh, another shout out to Debbie. Debbie, Pier 1. Beautiful bar car she got us from Pier 1. It is perfect. Fits everything that we need. It lets us display our wine glasses and our plethora of alcohol. Fabulous. We love it. Do you want to take over? Sure. Where are we heading to next? Well, we'll head into our master bedroom. Okay. Where we leave our laundry <laughs> and our slippers. Hmm. Where we lay our head at night. <laughs> Beautiful chandelier that we drill a hole through the air duct. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> yeah, we're uh, probably going to pay for that. One of my favorite web registry gifts. We don't know. It came unnamed, but this picture that I put on. We love it. And I want it forever. There you have it, folks. It's staying with us forever. We have the two special favorite boys by our side always. Baby Z and E. Our baby nephews. They're not so, not so much babies anymore. We have Ashley's workout corner right here and right there. Ashley's workout mirror. Yep, this is a, our at home gym. Definitely came in handy during quarantine. This is where we do the workouts. Oh, okay. Oh. It's okay. Um, you probably don't really care about this corner so much, but I really love it. Got all my perfumes, diffuser. For the gift. My sister got us this really cool map of the stars from when we got engaged, which is so special. Wait, no, this one's from Allison. We'll show JK, you. JK. We'll show you the one my sister got. It was really sweet as well. 
Um, and yeah. Oh, uh, this is our little makeshift plant <laughs> section for so, Zen. Yeah, we actually, so this is the ottoman that goes to our couch and we got a new coffee table during quarantine. So instead of getting rid of the ottoman, we moved it in here, Brennan's idea, great idea, babe. Uh, at first, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't like it, but then you sit here and let me just show you your view. It's just so peaceful and comfy and you can look outside, you can just sit here. Also probably the best place to get good reception. Well, there you go. Pretty comfy. You wanna take us outside? what sold us on this apartment. They showed us this and we were like, we absolutely need this outside space. It's amazing. So we've got this great table from Ikea that folds down, which is really convenient if you're looking for outdoor patio furniture. Highly recommend this one. And then if you'd like to follow me. Well, don't forget about that bad boy. Weber, nice. That's more your expertise, so. Yep, just showed them to him. First off. Wow. Is the succulent garden really blooming right now, thriving, especially these guys. She finally found her green thumb. What's this over here? The infamous egg chair. Looks comfy. Join me. It's kind of bright. Super bright. It's, like, you know, it's also like really hot. It's super hot. Usually we tan out here and not with our long sleeves and <sighs> jeans. Jeans. But we love it. This is nice, and then we usually say hi to our neighbor Jeff over there. He peeks over, right there in that corner. <laughs> um, now we're gonna go into. Oh, excuse our low light bulbs. They're so cute, though. They totally make the patio. But now... They do. They make the shot. Now oh, where are we going now? This is Ashley's room. The office. The office slash mm, Ashley's closet. Yes. Proud of it, baby. Wow. So this cleaner than it usually is. Yeah, but I, you know, I, I want it to Pretty be organized. real and leave the things how they usually are. You know, I could have put them away, but this is what the office usually looks like. I put, this, okay, this is also the guest bedroom, obviously, so when people stay, we clear it out very nicely. But when no one's here, this is where I lay out products that new brands have sent to me so I can show it to you guys on stories. Uh, this is Ooh, how sneak I peek of what's to come. Yeah, this is just kind of how I stay organized. Even though it looks a little bit cluttered and messy, this is so organized. Um, this and how many days out of the month would you say it's this organized? Probably 10. Mm. Oh, out of the month? Yeah. Probably three. There you go. Maybe two. This is the best desk ever. It was a really big purchase. Oh, but... Another poof? Oh, yeah, another poof. For comfort. Great purchase, where from? Urban Outfitters. Nice. Chair is Target, rug is Urban Outfitters, computer. Hashtag ad. I wish, it's not an ad. This corner over here is the Poshmark corner. Also, wow. always messy. Behind the scenes, this is the cleanest it's ever been. All yeah. in one place. It's, it's usually all over here. Now everyone's dizzy. Oh, sorry. This, yeah, this is it's this is the office, okay? It's it's bound to even be messy. Um, this was oh my shoes Brennan's close shoe that off. It was full. Used to be full, but we are in the process of moving out, which prompted this whole tour. So this was a joint closet. It was my jacket closet, Brennan's shoe closet, and these are my closets. Very Carrie Bradshaw having two closets on either side. Yeah. Um, and I love it, it's great. And then this is Brennan's bathroom that we also adorned with marble. Yes, we did. And it looks phenomenal. Phenomenal, yeah. shout out P Free. Always yeah. reminded me where we came from, where we met. We met in Santa Monica. If you watched the announcement vlog, you saw where we met. So this makes Just a lot more sense to you. Right around this <laughs> corner. Yeah, so. This is a great bathroom. This is Brennan's bathroom in my closet area. You know, it doesn't make a lot of sense, but it was perfect. Last place? Bathroom? I think so. Walk through here. Ashley's usually working down there. I'm usually laying right there. 
Oh, the wine fridge is crucial. Dinners are up there. We say hello to everyone from there. And Ash's bathroom. Yes, so this is my bathroom, hence the explosion of products. Uh, oh, sadly, products. Brennan got the medicine cabinet, so this is my medicine cabinet. This is my corner. Yeah, so my corner is just always like this. And that was one of the things that you learned moving in with me. Yes. Is that there's a lot of stuff on the couch. It's just a lot of stuff, and not even on the counter. Oh, me. At least it's organized. It's pretty organized. Um, shout out to quarantine. That was my first quarantine project, actually. My favorite part of the bathroom, I can't turn the light off because it'll be loud, but Brennan installed these amazing shelves from Amazon and they completely transformed the space. It was the easiest thing. Well, I guess, I don't know how easy it was. It's super easy. <laughs> it Just was the easiest thing for me to do to transform this corner. Oh, it's super, it. super easy thing for Ashley to do is to send me over here and put those shelves up. My um, handyman. This is the one that my sister got us and she read the blog from when we got engaged and she took what Brennan started out by proposing with this little sentiment and put it on there. So, so it's just a different version of the stars. But actually, this one has the constellations. That one has like all the stars. So sure. they are different. That's really cool. Yeah, so she wrote, we got engaged at 4.30 p.m. on October 15th, 2018. Seems like just yesterday. Nice, is that it? I think so. What a fabulous do apartment. Any, do you have anything else you want to add? Um, the beach sign up there is great. It's been with me for a while. Ah, she didn't like it, so she turned it around, and now it's white. Okay, that's fair. It's newspaper print on the other side with a bunch of colors. And I also Tunico love the beach. with our decor. But those colors didn't vibe, you know? They didn't vibe. But then, during quarantine, I turned them around and I was like, oh, they're white on the other side. And, and they so still say like beach. Perfect solution. Because we love the beach. We love the beach. The beach is our home forever. Well, you have a fabulous home. Thank you so much. Couldn't it be a home without you, baby. <gasps> oh, so nice. Oh, there it is. <laughs> we'll miss it. We will miss we it. We had some great memories in it. It's time to move on to the next chapter. Leave it for the next person. Yeah. We'll miss Jeff. We'll be back for sure because Jeff will be here so we get to see what this person did to this apartment after True. us. True. No pressure. Put wood floors in here. Yeah, they're going to put wood floors in the second we leave and we're a little bit bitter, but it's fine. That's all right. It was worth it. It was a fun three years. We were supposed to stay for one, then we stayed for three. And we made the best of it and had many of parties. We had, did have a lot of parties here. It was the best. The best first apartment. We learned a lot. Loved a lot. Had lots of friends oh, over. So much love. Good words. <laughs> but we are excited, and though we're a little nervous to get rid of it, we know that we are only headed to bigger and better plans. Yep. Hashtag next five year goals. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Thanks, guys. Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>
coffee corner, do a little pour over action. Usually how we start our mornings off. Just give it a little stir. And then we look at the barista at work. This is my coffee corner. The espresso machine. Wow. And my little oh, bag underneath. of chips. Got all my proteins under there. My coffee. How many scoops? It's just kind of like a feeling. Sometimes oh. it's two, sometimes it's two and a half. Just whatever the day brings, huh? Yeah. Still trying to perfect my latte. My, after, Mar my Americano now, actually. After good, thing, good things take time. Exactly. Americano is my new drink of choice. Which is just water and espresso. Well, that seems pretty easy. But, ooh, I'm out of my favorite protein. Oh no. That's a plot twist. Ancient nutrition. Always ancient nutrition. Usually I put vanilla, but just ran out yesterday. So the trick is to put the, put the protein in the hot espresso so that it properly disperses throughout the coffee. Nice. Put it in a cold beverage, it'll get chunky. Gosh. Mm. Don't want chunky beverages. Unless it's a smoothie. True. Uh, I don't want anything to be chunky. Not even chunky chicken noodle soup? That's the one thing I will have chunky. Mm. Probably gonna have to put a little bit of agave in this because there's no vanilla. Cheers.